Welcome to Prototype, released in 2009, developed by Radical Entertainment and published by Activision. You know, the guys that published the COD games. We know how good those games are nowadays, said no one ever. Anyways, I'm going to begin the Platinum Trophy for Prototype, and in the trophy list, we have 26 bronzes, 10 silvers, 4 golds, and of course, the best trophy of them all, the Platinum Trophy, equaling up in total to 41 trophies. So, I played this game back in February 2021 and managed to earn 6 out of the 41 trophies. So you're not going to see those 6 trophies, but you will see the rest. So hopefully you enjoy, this was a good one. Here we are man, back on Prototype 1. Truly an underrated game. Such a good game. Um, it's, been, it's been since February 2021 when I last played this game. And I left it. To play Prototype 2, and you want to know why? Because I tried finishing the story of Prototype 1, and I was on a mission, a story mission, and I just kept on dying. I could not complete it, so I was like, you know what? If I die one more time, I'm just gonna quit this game and move on to Prototype 2. I died, and then I never played it again after that. So now I'm back, and I'm gonna try to get this Platinum Trophy. It's very challenging, it's an 8 out of 10 difficulty and takes around 45 hours. So this one's gonna be tough, but uh, let's see how it goes. But yeah, let's get into it dude, I'm super excited to be back. How's this game feel? Uh, if This feels like a PS3 game. You can tell it's definitely a, but uh... Oh, circle? Oh yeah. And triangle, there we go. Nice. But, yeah, you can tell it's definitely age, but, uh, it's a classic, can't go wrong about it. Played this game back on, like, the Xbox 360, and that was a lot of fun. Like I said, man, I'm happy to be back on this game again. Yay, there we go. Right, that was my first mission done. That was not that hard at all. Was I just bad back then? Like, Jesus, but that was not that hard at all. Nice, nice, nice. Yes, let's go! Children of Blacklight complete the Supreme Hunter boss battle. Yes, sir. First trophy, man, let's go. It's him! Patsy 5 military personnel. It's him. It's him, guys. Oh, it wasn't him down dude but all, all along it's been me <laughs> so one of the hardest trophies in this game is the events so pretty much events are challenges you can do and there's four types of events you have movement kill war and glide events movement events is like your courses like just get the uh, markers and get to the you know final marker checkpoint whatever and then glide event, you have to glide into this green circle and the closer you are to the center, the more, um, you, the better your score will be. And then we have the kill events, which you just need to kill um, enemies with certain uh, stuff, like weapons, vehicles, whatever. And then war is you have allies and infected and you need to like, pretty much just win the war, win the battle. And what makes this trophy so tough is you need to get a platinum medal on all of these challenges, which is around 50. And some of these can be really ch tough, so I'm going to show some of the ones I had trouble with. I was literally 0.2 seconds off, plant dude. Oh my god. Yeah, I can really see the difficulty on this, dude. Let's go, man. Yes, 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 yes! Finally, let's go, dude. Give me that plat medal. Silver. Gold. Plat. Wait, what? Wait, what? Um. Why didn't I get the plat medal? It was 58 seconds, isn't it? Wait, what? Okay, so I need to get gold on. All the all, all of the events first. So I've got plat on this one. On the on the one I just did, but I need to get gold on all of these other ones, and then 
once I get gold on all these other events, that event I just did just then will uh, give me a plat medal. So, yeah, I didn't know that, but yeah, now I do. I was worried there, dude. Jesus. Yo, I think that was second try, dude. Hold on. Oh, damn it. I was... Uh, almost two seconds off. Damn it, dude. Apparently, this is the hardest movement event, so... Damn. Alright. Well, uh, let's keep going. Oh my god, I just smashed that! Hardest one my ass, that was like, I think that was the fourth try, maybe fifth. I just smashed that, yes! So yeah, the platinum medal is 36 seconds, but again, I need to get gold on uh, all, of, all of the events, so... Yeah, once I do that, this will automatically be a platinum medal, yes! Let's go! Oh, 0 0.1 seconds off. Are you joking? Yeah, this is the hardest one I've done so far, dude. I I, I would say it is. Oh, that ain't it, dude. Bro, this is... Yeah, this is the hardest one for sure, so far. Bro, uh, I don't know. I just keep going over the fucking checkpoints. Oh my god. No! Oh, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Oh my god. No! Was that 0 0.1 again? Oh, 0 0.2. Oh my god. Dude, I... That was it, bro. That was it. Why was my moment... Why was I falling down so slow? Oh my god. Yes! Yes, 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 yes! <sighs> Fuck that fucking course, dude. Yes! Yes! Yes, yes, yes! Let's go. Whew. Probably not the hardest, but it's the longest out of all of them. Let's go, bro. Yes. <sighs> it's done. All movement events are done with all platinum medals. Apparently, yeah, those events are the hardest, the movement events, out of the movement, gliding, uh, kill, and war events. Apparently movement is the hardest out of those four, so yeah, I'm happy to be done with all of them. Let's go! Yes, that was the hardest, um, glide event for sure, holy shit, dude, you have to be, like, so, like, specific on, like, where you need to land, Jesus, yes, yes, yes! Yes, that's it, let's go, oh man, that one was tough, dude, holy... Holy shit, uh. There we go, uh, gold. 
and platinum has been done for all uh, glide events. Most of them were pretty easy, but there was like maybe two or three which were pretty tough. But hey, happy to, happy to be done with those. Return fire, yes sir. Catch any object uh, tossed by a hydra and throw it back. That's missable, so I want to get that one out of the way. Endless hunger. Consume 200 characters to boost your health. Yep, easy. Fuck that mission, bro. That mission fucking sucks. I was on that mission for probably an hour, if I had to say. That was one of the worst missions I've ever done in history, in game. In Jesus, bro. I never want to do that shit again, but I have to. Fuck, I right know. Yes, on instinct. Finally, complete the mother boss battle. I think that took like an hour to do, dude. I can finally get off now. Yes, misconception. Destroy 25 infected water towers before they hatch. Super easy. Shouldn't be that many though, honestly. Should be less than 25, but hey. We'll take it. Depossession. Uh, seize 50 vehicles from enemy hands. Nice. Yay, 1000 suns. Complete the supreme hybrid boss battle. That's the story done, man. Let's go. Nice guy. Complete the game while consuming 10 civilians or fewer. Yeah, that one can be tough, but... Managed to do it on medium difficulty, let's go. So now I can consume civilians without any penalty. First playthrough is done, I need to do another two. So my second playthrough will be uh, New Game Plus, which is just to uh, complete the game without dying, which I can just play on easy, and again, New Game Plus, so it shouldn't be too bad. So I complete the game without dying, and then I gotta do one more mission without being de 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 detected. I uh, got two in this playthrough, so I just need one more, and then, yep, as soon as I complete that second playthrough, I'm going to get most of the miscellaneous trophies, like the challenges, the collectibles, and all that stuff, and then we have the third playthrough, which is probably going to be the hardest part of this game, which is hard uh, difficulty, so that should be great, but uh, yeah, let's just do the second playthrough. In the web, consume 50 web targets. They even mean to get that, but nice. The cleaner, what's this? Destroy 10 military bases or infected hives in New York City. I didn't do that. <laughs> Alright, sure. Self deception. Discover what happened to Alex Mercer through the web of intrigue. Oh, sick. Let's go, hard to kill, complete story mode in any difficulty without dying, yes sir. Let's go bro. Second playthrough done, now let's go do some miscellaneous stuff like collectibles and the best of the challenges, the war and um, kill events. And then we do hard difficulty which is probably going to be the hardest part of uh, this platinum. So yes man, yes man, let's go man. Infiltrate, uh, infil, 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 infiltrate 10 military bases disguised as a commander, yes, yasa. So now yeah, I'm just getting some miscellaneous trophies, um, didn't have my sound on because it was a bit boring getting all of these, especially the uh, consumer events because there's like nearly 40 of them and they're very repetitive, but yeah, these miscellaneous trophies were pretty easy, not that difficult at all. Just a bit grindy, but other than that, not too bad. Not too bad at all. Alright guys, we are about to get the last collectible trophy. This has been an absolute grind. Well, not these, not these um, web of uh, intrigues, but the landmarks and the... Um, Hint, uh, collectibles were a grind, but here we go. Web of knowledge, acquire all nodes of the web of intrigue. Yes, yes, yes. Dude, 
Like, those weren't bad. I got, like, majority of them. I had, like, ten left. Because I was, um, getting them along along the way when I was doing the, um, landmark and hint collectibles. But, um, yeah, here, look at this. 200 landmarks, 50 hints, and, like, look at this map. Like, it's so hard to see, you know, where exactly they are. And you can't even mark, you can't even mark anything. Well, you can, you can only mark, um, events, but you can't actually, like, mark, you know, if there's nothing there, you can't, like, mark it. So you can only, like, do events, which is really dumb, but, man, I, like, missed, like, five collectibles, and I was so annoyed, and it took me, like, two hours just to find the last five, so, yeah, got those, and then, yeah, did the... Web of Intrigue targets, and those were very easy because I didn't need to, uh, uh, do, uh, or didn't have a lot left, and, yeah, they're pretty easy to find if you need a guide, but, yeah, the landmark and the hint, uh, collectibles were a nightmare, honestly gave me some Assassin's Creed 2 flashback with those, uh, feathers, if you know, you know, but, hey man, I'm so glad to be done with this, uh, Platinum's gonna be done soon, boys. Let's go. With everything in the base game pretty much done, now it's time to finish off the kill and war events with Platinum Medals. I'm doing these on my second playthrough, because if you did these on medium or hard difficulty, they would be a lot harder. Once all of these are done, there will be two trophies remaining. So yeah, I'm gonna show you some highlights on these events, and hopefully you enjoy. Yes, yes, yes! Yes, my, yes, my. Second try. That one can be tough, dude. Let's fucking go! Wah! Yes! Bro, I don't understand this. 158? How am I supposed to get 200, bro? What the fuck? Yeah, apparently this is regarded as the hardest kill event. Maybe the hardest event in the game. What the actual fuck? Wrecking Yard, that's for destroying 2,000 vehicles, I can't look, but I know it is. No, dude, I was 11 off. You little cockfucker. That's the strat, though. There's a military base nearby. Just go there and just go ham. Come on, dude, I, got, I can do this. No, I was 6 points off, bro. I'm doing better, but fuck, man. I kind of... I think this relies on RNG, dude. I don't know why. I feel like that's what it kind of relies on. Bro, how am I doing worse, man? Like, I don't understand. Oh my god, bro. Let's go, dude. Yes, yes. 209. Yes. Thank fuck. Yeah, that was the hardest kill event for sure. But will it be the hardest in general? Maybe. That was so easy, dude. That was light work. Just just destroy the tanks and that's it. Uh, easy mode, let's go. Dude, this isn't fucking possible. I, I don't know how people are getting platinum medals on this. I don't see this being possible. Like, how? So again, for the platinum medal, you need 55 points. The timer is on the top screen, almost 30 seconds left. And every time you, you destroy a tank, it is 10 points. So yeah, let's see how this goes. Come on, that has to be it. Well, I got 55, so I should get the platinum medal. <sighs> I'm gonna get gold on all of the events, and I'm praying this becomes a platinum medal. Because this, that was harder than Demolition, the one that people consider the hardest kill event. Jesus, dude, that one was annoying, holy fuck. 
god, that was so easy. That was the easiest one for sure. I didn't even need to try. Jesus. Let's go, dude. I fucking hate these war events. I hate them so much. Gunnan, uh, destroy 20 helicopters in a single helicopter flight. Yes, sir. That's the way you can get that trophy pretty easily. Just do that event. Yes, sir. Clean up. Kill 15 characters with a single whip fist attack. Yeah. Again, like with the helicopter, that's the event you want to get that trophy. Let's go. Fucking hell, that was annoying. Jesus, fucker. We got a bloody known. We ain't running away. Over. God, that was so annoying. Jesus Christ, bro. Like I said, man, these war events suck. God, that was so annoying. I was honestly considering thinking that was not possible, but... Yep, kill the hunters and you should be good, but yeah, thank fuck. Yes, yes! God, that challenge is annoying, Jesus man, thank fuck. Yes! First try, man. All the war events are done. Let's go, dude. Yes. Now we only have three more kill events, and I'm gonna get two trophies for them. Let's go. I should get AU. Oh, I gotta uh, leave the event. Alright, let me leave. It should pop. There it is. AU. Achieve a rating of gold or better in all events. So now, I didn't get plat in that event just then, so I gotta go back and do that. But, uh, yeah, just two more events, I need the uh, plat. Yes, sir. Boys, it's done. I had to play this event again because the PSMP guide says the platinum medal's 145, but. That's for the gold. The platinum medal is 125, and now I'm about to get the trophy for getting all platinum medals. Here we go. You ready? PT achieve a platinum medal in all events. Yes, you have achieved platinum in all events. You are truly a prototype master. Holy! So now we have two more trophies, man, and this platinum's mine. Let's go, bro! Oh, I'm buzzing right now because these some of some of these events here were really, really, really hard. So I'm just super proud I got all of them done. Yes, sir. So now we have one trophy left. Complete the game on hard difficulty. Honestly, thought it was gonna be harder, but um, 
Elizabeth Green and, Sup and Supreme Hunter were like definitely like the hardest like bosses in the game for sure. Uh, Supreme Hunter took me the longest surprisingly and the reason is is because uh, well you'll see but um, I didn't use a certain power that makes the Supreme Hunter boss fight a lot easier so yeah man let's get this platinum done Oh my god, I think I did it. Oh my god, I'm, dude, I'm, he's literally one health. Don't try to get health, please. Wait, I can use it. I'm gonna use uh, Whiplash. Come on, this has to be it. Oh my god, I'm done. Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm done. Dude, Muscle Mass made this fight so much easier. Um, I didn't use it and I was on this fight for about two hours. Just started using Muscle Mass, upgraded it, and yeah, that was a lot easier. Oh my god. Alright, uh, you ready guys? Here we go. Give me a... Oh my god, revenge revisited, and platinum trophy, oh my god, it's done, dude, I'm so relieved, oh my god, I'm so relieved, that was one of the hardest platinums I've gotten for sure, Jesus, man. Oh, I'm so happy, bro. Here's some stats for you guys. Uh, 7 hours, 16 minutes. Um, I'll just go through these. 10 deaths, I died 10 times. I think I died more than that because, um... When I was doing, when I was on this fight for like 2 hours, I like got off. And I died a couple times to, um, to the boss. So I think, probably, let's just say like 15. But yeah, there you go. I'll just go through these, if, if, just in case you wanna, you wanna know what they are. But, but yeah, it's uh, it's finally done. And there we go, guys. The platinum trophy for prototype is done. So now I'm gonna get into some stats on uh, what I think about the game, how hard the platinum is, and how much I enjoyed going for the platinum. So, for the game, how much I enjoyed it, man, this would be higher, but because the game hasn't really aged well with the graphics and the gameplay being a little bit janky at times, uh, I'd give it an 8 out of 10. This is a truly, like, underrated game, and more people definitely need to play the Prototype series. Uh, they're just super fun, and the stories are great. And the plot twist in this game is amazing. So, yeah, I definitely recommend this game. But it just has not aged well. And if you have a PS5 and you're used to uh, 60 FPS, then uh, good luck playing this game because uh, this game is only 30 FPS. I mean, I didn't mind um, 30 FPS. I didn't really tell much of a difference, honestly. But, um,. Yeah, just uh, FYI, just in case you wanted to know. But, Platinum difficulty? Man, this Platinum was tough. From the challenges being really tough with the Platinum medals, to the boss fights on hard difficulty. It was really, like, difficult. But, I think I'd give it a 7 out of 10. The main difficulty for me just has to be, again, the Elizabeth Green and the Supreme Hunt boss fight, and then some of the challenges for the Platinum Medals. Like, those were pretty tough. But other than that, not too difficult at all. So I'd give it a 7 out of 10. Uh, platinum Enjoyment, how much I enjoyed going for the Platinum. Again, man, it's going to be like a... I'd give it probably a 4 out of 10. 
uh, a bunch of collectibles, over 300. Again, the platinum events, they have to get the platinum medals on. There was just a lot of them and frustrating at times. And then, again, finishing the game on hard difficulty. But, yeah. Uh, little, little time consuming, pretty tedious at times, frustrating at times. Honestly, like, there was times where I was really, really frustrated with certain parts of the game. Like, so frustrated that I haven't been this frustrated in a long time. So, yeah, that kind of, not, not soured my mood, but made me hate the game a little bit when I, um, was doing them. But, yeah, after getting the Platinum and doing everything, I love this game. Like, this game is underrated and more people need to play the series but anyways that's gonna be it for the video guys i really hope you enjoyed let me know what you think down in the comments below um i also stream these games on my youtube channel so if you'd like to check out the streams i'd appreciate it and yeah that's gonna be it guys uh hopefully i'll see you in the next one bye bye